editing videos, that's hard. But I'm gonna show you an easy way on how to do that using VideoPad. So stay with me throughout this video. What's up guys, Zeb here, and today we're gonna to be talking about how to edit your videos to get them uploaded to YouTube. So I'm gonna be doing this using a program called VideoPad, and I'm gonna show you a quick and easy method so you can get this completed. All right, but before we get started, let me introduce myself to those that don't already know me. My name is Zeb Summers. I'm an online entrepreneur. I talk about make money online, affiliate internet, digital marketing, and I'm here to help you through your journey to a laptop lifestyle so you can get some freedom in your life. Now guys, if you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, click that little notification bell, give me a like and drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you like, what you don't like, would like to see in the future. All right guys, now if you are more interested in a passive income, one that can make you a full-time online income, click the link down below. My number one recommended, make a full-time income online. Click that link and I'll send you over some information. All right, now let's get right on with the video on how to use the program called VideoPad. All right, so I'm gonna show you an easy way to use this program right here. It's called VideoPad Professional and it's by NCH Software. So just go ahead and download or go get a copy of this. So I think I pay, uh, it's a monthly fee for this. I think it's like $11 a month and it's a great program. So, you know, if you don't have the money for Camtasia or some crazy expensive program like that, or Adobe Premiere, use this program. This program will do it for you. And that's how I edit my YouTube videos is with this. So you're going to, I'm going to give you this very simple step-by-step -step instruction here, all right, guys? So the first thing you want to do is open up the software, okay? It's going to bring you to this page. It might bring you to a page where you actually see, you know, tips and tricks, but just close it out and follow my lead here, all right? So the first thing we want to do is we want to add files, all right? So I'm going to show you exactly how I do my videos, all right? So I'm just going to drop this video in here. This is one from last week, I think. So this is one of the videos, and this is my hook video, all right? Then I'm gonna show you, uh, I have some more videos, and these are my like sound, my intros, my exit, all that stuff. So I'm gonna walk you through exactly how I do my video, okay? So you add all your videos that you want, all right? There's, there's many different ways you can do this, and this is just one way I'm gonna do do this to show you exactly how I do my videos okay so I don't even know what this video is here but I'm uploading it and guys it's very simple so the first video you want to do is we want to bring it down into here you know I'm just gonna cancel this we're gonna bring the video down in here okay so this would be your hook video all right and that's your video all right so you'd want to edit it so you'd want to watch it a little bit, listen to it. Uh, I'm going to hit the mute button so we don't hear it, but you know, you'd want to play it, make sure it sounds right. You can stop it at any point. You can, if you wanted to edit some of it off, you just cut it off like this. Stop. It cuts that little piece off. All right. So then you would start at the beginning. You would listen again, so on and so forth. All right. So the next thing you want to do is drop your next video right in. So that's my intro, right? If I want to edit my intro, if I want to chop some time off, if I want to chop some time off the end, right, to make it a little shorter, say I wanted to drop a new soundtrack in, all right? I have these audio files. I just drop these right in here, right underneath. It's got a little line. It drops it. This is how long it is. I can just shorten this. You see this dotted line right here, that's dropping it right in. So I just added a new sound over top of what was currently there. I just muted what was there, okay? So that's how easy it is. I'm going to keep all these muted so they don't blow up while I'm trying to speak here, okay? So now that I got my hook in there, I got my intro, and I'm just going to use this video again as a uh, sample i'm just i'm just using this as an example but this will be my long video okay so i got my hook 
my intro, and then my video. And it's as easy as just dragging these in here, okay? So if I wanted to put, say, a background sound in, in while, while I was talking, I would come over here and I would just grab one of these, all right? And I'd put this background sound on here, okay? I'd shorten it to make sure that it's there, all right? So it's it's this full length of this, okay? And then I would expand this button, and I'd only make this like 50%, okay? So I'd want 50% so it's a background sound while I'm talking, okay? So you can do that as well while you're talking and creating your video, all right? So now that that's done, you want to put on your ending your 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 outro or whatever you want to call it okay so i just have a video and i mean i just have an image that i use at the end of my in my videos that i spread out you can spread it to however many second long you want 16 seconds okay so now when i get to here this shows me this image and what i do is i just go in here and i drop in my my uh videos my subscribe button and bam that is my video all right so once you're ready once you're ready for your video to be uploaded and you know i i, I want to add an audio to the back end of this all right so i don't want my outro just to show a picture with nothing so i just throw this video i mean this audio into here okay and now another cool thing about the audio is if you click on the audio and they come up here to clip preview it'll show the audio clip now you could drag and drop this wherever you want and and cut out the pieces that you want or you could do it down here okay now another cool feature is is you can do a quick fade out so if you click fade out and you click say five seconds you'll see on here when the when the song starts to fade out okay so you can do that as well and that's a real easy way to do this now another cool feature is green uh using my subscribe button let me show you how i throw that in here okay so just for instance just for an example's sake just say right here is where i'm saying hey if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button so i would drop in this button okay this is a pre-made button on a green screen okay and then i would just come up here i'd hit video effects hit green screen all right click this green button click the the mark mark a little dropper to get that exact color hit okay then i come down here and i'll hit 90 and i hit 20. don't ask me why i picked these numbers they just seem to work and that's the numbers that i use okay so that's just as easy as it is so then i come back over here and then you can see how i just drop that right in there okay boom nice simple easy it's it's there right so that's how you create your video and and that's all it's to it guys i mean it's very simple if I, say i wanted to add now say i want to add some some text to it okay i can do this very simple as well i can just come over here add text i can add you know simple text overlay you know, uh, we'll just leave it title text i can make it you know maybe this is 60 so it gives a little bit of a highlight here i come back over here and here's my text block okay i can actually bring this and drag it wherever i want so now i see it down here okay so that's how easy this program is okay and i could add objects i could add images the same way as i do this text uh all kinds of stuff okay so guys this is the easiest way to make your video once you have the video where you want it all right you just come up here export video click video file you name it right you name your test video for youtube i use this youtube 1080 hd and then i just hit create this creates your video it's pretty quick for a new normal video of mine they take about 15 minutes or so but guys this is called video pad give me a thumbs up if you feel like this got this is of some value to you I was trying not to be all over the place. I'm trying to just walk you through the process that I go through. And this is it. This is how I put my videos together. You know, I come in here, I cut it out, cut out the pieces I don't want. 
you can split it if you feel like it. You know, you can right click, you can unlink your video or mute your audio, all kinds of stuff. All right. So it doesn't take long to learn how to do this. And I taught this, I taught myself how to do this like in maybe a couple days it took me, but here's the video. All right. So here's that quick video that I made. <clears throat> of course, you probably don't want to look at my ugly mug right there, but guys, this is that video, right? Here's the the text I put in, you know, here's the intro, what? then it bounces back oh, into here, all right? And it, it and you see the subscribe button, you see all of it, all right? So that's the video. That's how easy it is to make a video with VideoPad. Guys, hopefully you got some kind of lesson here. Hopefully you came here looking how to create a video using VideoPad and left knowing what the hell you're doing now. All right, guys, again, peace out. Catch you on the next video. Sorry this wasn't a make money affiliate marketing, but I had a request forced from someone to actually make a video using UPad, video pad. So here it is. Peace out, guys. I'll catch you on the next video.